The LSU Ag Center's Swine Farm does more than just help students learn about raising food animals. It also helps with medical research for you and me. Last week we told you about the LSU Ag Center's plans to shut down its swine unit or possibly transfer its operation to the LSU College of Agriculture. This week in Louisiana Agriculture's Kristen Oaks now shows us what could be lost if the swine unit closes. Not many college guys have a special relationship with a 700 pound boar named Puddin, except for Brendan Terry. Well, it's not often you can do what you love, especially being a student. Since his freshman year, Terry has cared for Puddin and the other pigs here at the swine unit on the LSU Ag Center's Ben-Hur Research Farm. But just like his fellow co-workers, closing the swine farm means Terry will be out of a job. Pretty devastating. Uh, you know, after working here for three years, uh, you know, you get a little attached to it. Terry says the pigs here are more than just pets. They're teaching tools. They use our pigs for uh, medical research. You know, they train doctors to work on pigs because their uh, body anatomies are so close to humans. Swine unit manager Rebecca Lorette says they supply pigs to the Tulane, Oshner, and LSU Sciences Medical Schools for pre-med studies. Down in Tulane, we've worked out um, and been able to supply them with pigs that train doctors. You know, they're able to train physicians at Oshner's to use equipment that can save lives. LSU Ag Center researchers even collect blood samples from newborn piglets for human stem cell research. And they do that with our pigs because our hogs are healthy, they're consistent, we can supply them. We try and benefit them and help them for the good of us all. Lorette said the farm also supports the few swine breeders left in the state. We want to better understand how people can raise hogs in open fields, how people can raise hogs conventionally. There's many different ways to skin a cat and we're just trying to find ways where these small producers can make more money with the resources that they have. And they look to us for guidance and support and help. From bacon to med school, pigs like Puddin use their lives to support yours. In Baton Rouge, I'm Kristen Oaks for This Week in Louisiana Agriculture. Dr. Kenneth Koontz, who is the Dean of the College of Agriculture at LSU, says the college will hopefully have a plan in place to save the swine farm by the end of this year.